بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم السلام علیکم آئی تھنک دس ویل بی مور آف ووٹ آف تھینکس ٹو یو نو مائی لیٹ فادرز بیسٹ فرینڈ ہز کالیگس ہز سپورٹرز دا بورڈ ممبرز آر سٹنگ ہیئر اینڈ آئی تھنک وین وی ٹاک اباؤٹ دا رول ماڈل آئی تھنک اٹ واز رائٹلی سیٹ that my late father's passion was education and I think uh, uh, what he has done for, for the city and, and for the country as a whole uh, I think it would be I think many generations that will be inshallah attending this institute and uh, uh, will work successfully in various sectors of this country uh, I think I was very fortunate to Uh, for the last 22, 23 years uh, to be, to work uh, with, along with my father as a son and as also as his subordinate. He was my boss for the last 22, 23 years. I think I learned a lot f- from him. I think as rightly said, he has always been very humble. Uh, I mean, people would come to us and, uh, you know, his friends or his, you know, people he knew for past many years and they would ask for something from us. And Sabina and I would say that, why would we want to do something for them? Because they were not very nice to you in the past. And he would always tell us, they're always, always be humble. Okay, it's not their fault that something happened between their parents and me. You should always help them out and go out of your way to help the children of the people I knew and they deserve your help. And I think the, the type of, uh, uh, I think, lessons he, I think he inculcated on all of us, on all his children, Uh, I think is uh, I think we need to uh, take that forward uh, I'll just uh, give you one example because we are running out of time uh, in 1993 I went to the States um, I was about to settle there in 1993 I had studied there so uh, I was about to settle so I called my father and I said that look Uh, I'm here and uh, most probably I'll be settling here because I have some uh, offers from here and I think I'll do well financially. Um, so uh, if you can allow me to do that. And I still remember that call. He got really upset at me. And he said that I have not sent you to study abroad to stay there. I had sent you for you to come back and serve the country as I'm doing. And I always remember those words. And I think within the next two weeks, I decided to come back and help him out in his vision. For the students over here, I think my, what I've learned from my father, I want to convey that to you, that family is extremely important. I think respect your parents, help your siblings, help your family members. I think we take it for granted. The family will always be there. And whenever they need us, we are missing from their, uh, from their life. I think don't do that. I think because of your smartphones, because of social media, we are always busy using that uh, instrument and in- ignoring our family. I think All of us, like what my father taught us and told us, that always be there for your family, for your friends, and for the people who deserve the most. I think during his last years, I think his passion, and he was really passionate about it, was the outreach program. He wanted the institute to reach out to those who cannot afford to come to this institute. And he, I think he left everything aside 
He gave me and Sabina all the other responsibilities, and he concentrated on this one area to, uh, uh, to uh, recruit those students who really deserve that. I think I'm very honored that our board, under the uh, chairmanship of our chancellor, have supported us in that initiative. This year, our uh, internal financial assistance has gone to about 72 million rupees. And with external support that we are getting, I think we will have about 90 million rupees to our disposal in which we can provide financial assistance to those who need the most. And I think we are very active in recruiting students from TCF. That was his dream, to recruit those students from that stream, from TCF, and also from Interior Sindh. So we have been doing that. And I hope that we'll, we will continue with his vision, with his, what he wanted this institute to be. And I'm sure that uh, you know, with the support of this uh, great board that we have, that we will achieve and we will continue to achieve those targets. I'm extremely uh, grateful to Sladin Qureshi Saab. He's also a batch mate of my father, 1957 batch. I'm extremely grateful to Justice Saab. He has been our board member for such a very, for such a long time. Mr. Bashi Jan Mohammad Saab, the chancellor, and from day one, he's the founder member of, of the institute, and also from day one, chairman of our executive council. Mr. Jahangir Siddiqui, also a founder member, a huge supporter of uh, this institute. I know he has just arrived, and I sent him the message yesterday and he's here today. I'm very grateful to you, Jangi Saab. Uh, Mrs. Amina Sayyad, um, um, I think my father always spoke very highly of your family. They were good family friends, um, and uh, 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 she's now part of our board. Uh, the deans, the rector, the advisors, uh, the faculty members, and of course the students. I think the purpose uh, for us to invite the students uh, was to learn about your founder president to know uh, more about him and uh, so that uh, you know we can learn uh, from from him from his personality and be humble and serve this country i think this country needs youngsters like you and i think we need to really make this country great i know we are going through a lot of problems we are going through a lot of uh, issues within the country but i think we should not give up and i hope that, uh, that we've fallen on the footsteps of Mr. Shah Jahan Karim, who has served this country uh, for over 60 years and uh, loved this country till the very end. I thank you again for being here and uh, for being part of this uh, event uh, today. Thank you very much.